Welcome back to Shai's Daily Trivia. Today's trivia questions will be on coconuts, so sit back, grab a drink, and let's get this started. I will ask you a trivia question and give you roughly 25 seconds to answer before I give you the answer. Just so you know, all the answers will be displayed roughly 25 seconds after the question is asked. But the answers are also on another video over on our sister channel, Shy's 13 Random Facts, about anyone, anywhere, and anything. You may want to watch that video first to learn all the facts. So let's have some fun. Let's get this trivia started. Question number one. When first seeing the coconut for the first time in the 16th century, why did the Portuguese and Spanish sailors give it the name coconut? While we are waiting for the answer, I'll take this time to say please remember to hit the like, subscribe, and the notification buttons below this video. Answer number one. Portuguese sailors in the 16th century named the coconut because of the three holes on the coconut looked like a human face. Question number two. According to a report from 1984, what percentage of injuries at a hospital in New Guinea were caused by falling coconuts? See, if you watched our other video, 13 Random Facts, you'd know this answer. Answer number two. According to a report in 1984, 2.5% of injuries treated at a hospital in New Guinea were caused by falling coconuts. Question number three. In a Hindu wedding ceremony, a coconut is placed over the opening of a pot. Why? Of course, if you want more time, you can very easily hit the stop button on the video while you try to figure out the answers. But seriously, what fun would that be? And your answer is, in Hindu wedding ceremonies, a coconut is placed over the opening of a pot representing a womb. Interesting. When I look at a coconut, I don't think of a womb. Question number four. How many millions of years ago do the oldest fossils known to the modern coconut date back to? How many millions of years ago do the oldest fossils known to the modern coconut date back to? Drum roll please. Answer number four. The oldest fossils known of the modern coconut dates from the Eocene period from around 55 million to 37 million years ago. Question number five. The fossils of the modern coconuts that date back to 55 million to 37 million years ago from the Eocene period, what countries were they found in? Do you know? These questions seem a little harder than normal today. Good thing there's only eight questions. Even stumping me. And I know the answers. Answer number five. Modern coconut dating from the Eocene period from around 55 million to 37 million years ago were found in Australia and India. Well, now you know. Question number six. What is the flesh of the coconut called when it's dried? Dried flesh? No, couldn't be that easy, could it? How you doing so far? Are you getting most of them right? Let us know down below in the comment section. We'd like to hear from you.
And your answer to number six or six. When a coconut is dried, the coconut flesh is called copra. Not to be mistaken as that snake called the cobra. Question number seven. How many growth hormones that are beneficial for the development of many organisms can be found in coconut oils? Don't forget to pound that subscribe button on your way out. We'd love to have you subscribe to us. Come back daily. Answer number seven. Coconut oils contain four growth hormones that help the development of many organisms. Well, that's nice to know. Question number eight, and I believe this is our last question of the day. What was used for IV drips during World War II? Mainly because there wasn't enough blood plasma available. Hmm, what could it be? I'd like to take this time to say thanks again for watching, and hopefully we'll see you soon in another Shy's Daily Trivia video. Have you got the answer yet to the last question? Have you figured it out? Answer to number eight. During World War II, coconut water was used as an IV drip because there was not enough blood plasma available. Well, that's nice to know. Anyway, I do hope you had fun and enjoyed yourselves. I hope you all have yourselves a great day. And I hope to see you back here again tomorrow for our new trivia of the day. Bye for now.